yo guys you're welcome back to my youtube channel this is across nigeria where we do news on politics celebrities and also metro story um this past week okay this past days um there was a lot of controversy should i put it that way and um a lot of saga going on in nigeria ranging from the Koza issue about rape incident and also um the issue of the saga of um, Senator Elisha Abu of um, assaulting a lady, a nursing mother, in um, a sex toy shop in Abuja. All right. So um, today is Thursday, the fourth of um, July, two thousand and nineteen. Um, time check here is um, six thirty-four p.m. That is when uh, the time I'm giving you this report. So he made an apology um, that was on Wednesday yesterday um, that he is sorry, apologizing to the whole Nigerians about the incident. So the update of this story, just like I promised you that I was going to bring you every details and update about um, uh, this incident. So um, the news that I have here to share with you is that um, a legal practitioner Jewel um, Akomo Lafi um, have stated that Senator Elisha Abu could be jailed for a term ranging between three to five years as provided by section 262 to 264 of the panel code. That is, if only he is found guilty of the assault and battery. All right. So, um, it was also gathered that the lawyer, however, added that if it can be proven, okay, so let us get a point here. The lawyer said if only it can be proven that the senator's action was provoked and not intentional, then the sentence could be less between three months and one year. He further called for caution, pointing out that um, the camera only showed a fraction. Okay, so I'm also uh, going to um, react on this. Okay, the lawyer said the camera only showed a fraction of what happened and Abu may have acted in self-defense. Okay, so we are not going to argue about that. Um, I really don't know if you guys may understand it in a different perspective, but I'm only giving you my own humble opinion. Yes, it was a CCTV camera that, um, you know, that showed the, the footage, um, but just like what this lawyer said, all right, um, the, the, the footage only showed some fraction of what happened, and he may have acted in self-defense. So, um, Akumola Fee's um, sentiment was also shared by another lawyer, um, Judy, who, however, stated that if... Uh, there were grievous um, injuries to the victim, such as um, loss of eye, um, bastard um, eardrum, among others. Then the lawmaker's punishment could be more than five years. He also added that the judge, however, could exercise his um, discretionary power by giving the senator the option of fine or imprisonment or both if convicted so the first time um senator could also be suspended by the upper uh, legislative chamber for a maximum of 14 days if found um, culpable after investigation are uh, concluded all right so that is the story so far so good and i really don't know your own reaction all right um investigation is still ongoing um today is thursday i think the police um, um, invited him to the headquarter, police force headquarter in Abuja. Um, they invited him. So I don't have the story for that now. So if this is your first time to follow up this story, just like I promise you that I'm going to bring you every necessary details and updates concerning this story. So um, if this is your first time on my YouTube channel, just click on the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon so you get notified whenever i have um, 
updates concerning this story so this one i just um have this story to share with you guys so the senator um is asking everybody okay to to use caution in judging him pointing out that the camera just like I, I just like I, I told you on my own point um, point of view I really don't know about you the camera only I think it was just a 10 minute footage okay and the footage only showed when everybody was in the scene all right it was just like a movie scene uh, the footage only showed when everybody was already at the scene all right and it was only the fraction of what happened that we saw okay so we really don't know what transpired so if only um they, they were gonna have a footage the full camera footage from um the beginning maybe the beginning of that day okay um then everybody will be able to know the investigation will be able to you know decide or determine what actually happened just like what this um, lawyer said that um, Senator Abo could have uh, could have acted in self-defense. I know a lot of you may say I'm trying to defend him, but no, I am not. Um, I'm not um, uh, associated to any political party. Okay, I'm just a neutral person. I'm here to give you news what is going on across Nigeria. But I'm only sharing my own point of view. So if you have your own point of view, you can also share it with me. But I don't know if you guys. We'll see it in my own um, in my own angle. You may have your own um, perspective, okay. But what I am saying, I'm only trying to agree, okay. I'm only sitting at the fence. I'm neither here nor there. I'm not um, saying the the senator was right. Even the footage showed that he um, he he was beating the lady, no doubt. But just like what um, this lawyer says. We really don't know what happened, what transpired to that incident, because it was only the fraction of the assault, okay, um, that was shown. So um, let us exercise patience and see the next action, how the investigation is gonna go. All right. So um, to follow up this story, this is across Nigeria. Make sure you subscribe. Support me by clicking on that red subscribe button. I am gonna appreciate it so much all right so that is the update of this story i just want to share with you my guys my friend my subscribers because i promise i'm here to give you all the necessary information news about politics in nigeria celebrities and also metro stories all right so um if you have anything to contribute if you have your own humble opinion okay you can also put it down on the comment section below I will see you guys in the next video.